Hey guys, it's Melinda here. So today I just thought I'd jump on and do a really quick uh, update on baby girl. I had, oh, got an itchy eye, had my 39 week appointment. I'm freezing so I have my dressing gown on but I am 39 weeks tomorrow. So do a week from tomorrow that is just insane. Like it is so crazy. Um, so... I have not been feeling the greatest and I expressed this to the midwife this morning and um, so with my gastric sleeve I can't eat much anyway <clears throat> so they've been concerned about baby's growth um, I had a follow-up ultrasound at 36 weeks and all that came back good she's growing really nicely perfect everything is fine amniotic fluid, the cord, everything, placenta. Um, and I've lost a kilo since then. Um, I've just been getting headaches. I've been turned off like most foods. I find it hard to drink. Like I can go the entire day without drinking and eating. And I feel like crap, but I feel like crap anyway. Um, <clears throat> I just feel really run down and like I'm done <laughs> but I'm so thankful that it's been fine up until now um, like I've been really really lucky I really have um, and I know that this is kind of like you know awkward spot and like all random but I'm just wanted to get this up really quick because you never know when it will be the last time I can film this um, <laughs> So yeah, I expressed all this to the midwife and basically I had like a stress test done for half an hour, 45 minutes, <coughs> where they monitor contractions and um, heartbeat and all that and everything was fine, Marley passed with flying colours. Her movement has been, <coughs> um, her movement has been a little bit less during the day, like I'm not feeling it as much. Um, but she, that could just be because she's running out of room. <laughs> um, I am seeing a doctor next Friday instead of a midwife just to possibly talk about induction and that sort of thing just because it would be safer for her to be outside than to be in my stomach at this point. I still have really low iron. I can't take the iron tablets because of my IBS. It just flares it up. Um, and yeah, that's basically where we are at. It's just a waiting game. Um, I have no signs of labor. I'm guessing they're going to check me at 40 weeks for dilation and that sort of thing. So I know nothing as of yet. I'm really out of breath, really exhausted. I have a nap during the day and I still sleep fine at night time. Um, I'm really lucky because obviously Mia's at school, so I'm able to just relax while she's at school and take a nap and stuff and Matt and me have both been really helpful with like cleaning and just helping with things and I am struggling at meal times though like just trying to think of good things for the family to eat for dinner and um we did have takeaway a couple of times last week and <sighs> that's just not what I want I don't want to be eating takeaway and I know that we'll probably get it a few times when she's born <laughs> Um, but yeah, other than that, like everything is good. We are well prepared. Car seat, we put the car seat in when I was 37 weeks and two days pregnant. Um, but to make sure you are following me on social media and stuff, because I will post pictures and, um, things on there more likely on Instagram than Facebook, um, just because it's a lot easier. Um, what else? Yeah, I don't really make this huge, big update because I know a lot of people don't really have time to sit down and just watch, you know, like a 15-minute video. But um, I haven't made one for a while and I just figured this could be the last update I make. Might not be. A, there still might be a couple of updates. I don't know. Um, but I really am hoping that she comes soon. Mia's birthday is on Wednesday. Today is Thursday. So it's six days away. And each day... We get closer to Mia's birthday, I start to freak out going, oh my god, what if the girls are born, <laughs> like, have the same birthdays. Um, 
but whatever's gonna happen is gonna happen so yeah that is about it for that little update but everything is fine I'm just feeling really run down like I'm glad that it's me and not Marley um, I'm glad that everything is good with her um, but definitely feeling it now <laughs> but you like I said before I am really thankful that it is just now that I'm starting to feel really gross and it's not been like the entire pregnancy so um yeah I'm out of breath so I'm going to go and edit this video and hopefully get it up I also have a little vlog that um we filmed over the weekend and stuff that I want to get up but hopefully when Marley's born I will be able to get back into the swing of vlogging and just having regular videos and stuff but time is just flying and I cannot believe that my due date is next Friday so yeah that is it for my 39 week update and I'll see you guys soon bye